Uh, okay, so let's start again. Hello, uh, my name is Lulu Amante. I am the 2011 Miss California Teen Achieve. Um, <clears throat> my throat is a little bit exhausted from this weekend, so I'm sorry. And I apologize for um, my moments where I have to <coughs> catch myself like now. Um, I am very proud to announce that the 2012, 2012 Miss California Teen Achieve is Miss South Pasadena Teen Achieve Kalinda White. Yay! Um, today was a very, very moment. Um, a very joyful and momental moment, momentous moment in my life. Um, no, my high school life, not my life, my high school life. Um, <clears throat> as you can see, I still have makeup on, I still have my earrings on. I just um, still came back from my pageant, so, woo, I'm so excited. Um, <clears throat> so, I am still in the process of, you know, trying to relax and get back into things. Um, this past week has been busy, busy, busy. We're working on doing the girls' ads, trying to f make sure everything's organized and help out and as much as I can. And so, um, today, our, my weekend began on Friday at the coronation dinner where I crowned 13 of our delegates. And as Miss uh, California Teen Achieve, and ten were actually throughout <clears throat> the show this week. We had ten delegates who were t uh, teens, and seven delegates who were junior teens. So it was really exciting. I was so, so wait, thirteen or seven, I believe. No, we had twelve girls who were teens. Sorry, I'm like a little bit off. I don't have my program. I lost my her. My program is still with Michelle, so I need to get that back. But I am so exhausted. I am completely sorry, but yeah, I'm exhausted. So, <clears throat> as I was saying, Friday began um, as I was crowning the delegates, and of course I got to meet the parents, and I, I love meeting the parents. I don't know why. I'm just this very personable person where I just like love interacting and meeting people. So that's that's just who I am, and so I loved meeting them. I loved meeting, I met some grandparents, met some friends, and so it was cute, you know. And then um, Saturday, Saturday, yesterday, just so not the business, so not the business. Um, but um, well, actually, here let me announce. This weekend we had a very special guest. Um, now one of probably my one of my close friends. Um, in the process of becoming close friends. <laughs> um, <clears throat> we had one of the American Idol contestants from season nine, Miss Michelle Dillamore, as one of our, our special guest judges and also special guest appearance, um, who she, um, where she performed on Friday night and she also performed today. And so it was fun. I got to meet her sister. Got to meet her mother. Got to meet her mother. Her or momager, as like she says, and uh, one of her, her guitar her guitar player, uh, Elias. So they've become really close. And so it's like my tia Priscilla and my uncle Elias and Charlotte and Michelle. And so they're so cute and they're so adorable. I love them to death. And they've definitely they're amazing. They totally made my weekend. They told me. Made, they totally made me feel safe, made me feel relaxed. I just felt so comforted. So thank you guys so much. Special shout out to you guys. I love you guys so much. Ah. So, um, so Saturday she actually had her workshop, which I definitely enjoyed. It was about just being who you are, persevering at hard times, and just having fun with your life, you know. So I loved it. Um, then also we had a special guest named Nancy who spoke about... Um, scholarship opportunities and how to she how to prepare and look for them so i kind of really like that because my platform is providing educational opportunities for low-income youth so definitely <clears throat> been able to do that uh let's see what else saturday the girls had their talent competition definitely a lot of um 
competitive talent there. I'm going to have to say we had instrumentals, we had dancers, we had monologues, we had girls who had visual arts, like photography, and so I really enjoyed it and I really liked it. Um, let's see, what else? Um, now today, let's talk about today. So let me know, I made a video earlier and I was supposed to post it on Facebook and the internet was just not, it was just not happening. It was just like, and I had... It had gotten deleted, and I was so sad. But anyways, so today, the big day, coronation day, started off early in the morning, and we started off right off the bat getting ready for interview. So I was first, I began working with the junior teens, talking about poise, preparation, what to do in the interview. So it was really good. I am so close to sleeping right now. It's not even funny. I'm just not going to go to school tomorrow. <laughs> um, just preparation of posture, what to say, how to enunciate. Um, definitely taught a lot of girls, taught girls a lot of things this weekend um, that I've learned from other pageants and definitely carried on and definitely wanted to contribute to girls. So, and let's see what else. This weekend, oh yes, and then yes, then later on I went to my teens. I took care of my teens. I love my teens. My teens were amazing. They treated me very well. They are like my little, my little, um, how would I say? I don't know. I felt like a teacher and I was just teaching them, you know? Teaching them my experience, showing my experiences and showing them I love them. They worked very well with me. I had no complaints about them. And I, we, I think we felt really open. I had a really good relationship with each and every one of them. Um, <clears throat> I try to help each and every one of those girls as much as I can to my full abilities. So, and they did wonderful today. I loved them because they have their own individuality. They have their own different personalities. They have their own different goals. And I loved them so much. I So shout out to all you girls and de each and every one of you guys. You guys have so much potential ahead of you. And I've told you that at the workshop. I look at this program and I see these amazing accomplishments that you guys have. And I truly believe that you guys can all go further in life and definitely be leaders of our world and definitely become great role models to the youth of our generation. Um, and so, uh, let's see. Later on, we started getting to the show and it was just like, ah! So, um, the show began with opening number, uh, um, sportswear, and then we had a top four uh, talents, which were Kalinda, McKay, no. You know, it's so hard for me. Like, I've gotten way too many concussions. So I don't remember names as easy as easily as I did before. I know Daniela's song, song by Dell, I believe. Um, my new, cur the new current junior team put the p saxophone. Um, and we had one more. Judith played the violin. She's so cute. She's adorable. She reminded me of Julie last year. And so, um, um, yeah, it was really good. Uh, and then we got into evening gown. And then, um, it was just so good. I, I got into my last moment where I did my speech. Did not turn out as well. Okay, well, after intermission of my, my, of the evening gown, <laughs> it looked like, <laughs> um, what else? What happened? I, um, I, 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 what did I do? I did my talent. I did my musical martial arts. And if, and no, if anybody has ever seen my, my talent, it's like vicious. Like, I am like, I totally throw people off. And it's so, it's awesome. I love my talent. That's what makes, that's one thing that, that separates me from the other girls is my talent. So, um, I was so excited to show it, and I definitely scared all these people, and they just were like, oh my god, ah! <laughs> and so I did it, and it was really good, I liked it, and so then the girls came, and then revisiting Royal too. oh my gosh, shout out to my bestie, Taylor. Even though we don't see each other, and even though we don't go to school with each other, and we don't do text like on and off, we're like besties, we're like pageant besties, like how Julie, Ju uh, Juliet and I from uh, Miss Team Barca are like total pageant besties, like well, Taylor and I were like this, like she was the first girl I, I, I met in this pageant, like... She was my, I went to my orientation, and she was one of the first girls there, and I met her, and we were just like, damn, we were like this. 
we're like homies. And then, and then um and at that time we both had braces and then now another year later we're back with different like with different titles and no braces and it's all so like spazzing over her and so um she's beautiful she's wonderful so shout out to you taylor love you send so much love oh my gosh my eyes are so droopy <laughs> and so then my final moment where i said my farewell so, if anybody recorded it, please send it to my link down here below. I Okay, the reason I really, really want it, I totally winged the whole thing. I did not have any speech. I did not prepare. I had a farewell video that I was supposed to play, but I didn't get a project. I, didn't, I was, didn't, was not prepared, and I did not have a projector. So, I winged my speech, and I totally loved it, and I was bawling. I was like, ah! Oh my gosh, this eyeshadow looks really nice on me. I don't really use makeup, but it looks good on me. But I was bawling. I was like, ah, oh, somebody save me. I'm so sad. So I did my last final walk, and I just loved it. It was a very momentous and joyful moment of my life. And I was like, yay. So then I was crying and bawling, and then the moment came and I crowned. And the crowns were all right. They weren't the best, but they're all right is all I gotta say. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so we crowned, and we crowned Miss Kalinda White. Oh my gosh, we're at 11 minutes. Who cares? Somebody's gonna be watching this anyways. So, I feel so bad for who's watching this. I'm so sorry. If you're still watching this, thank you so much. <laughs> um, but yes, and I had a very wonderful time. Each and every one of you teens, I love you so much. You guys are my teens, and you guys... Are not just my teens. You guys are my friends. Facebook friends. So hit me up. I want to see those pictures. I'm going to steal them. I'm put them on my Facebook. <laughs> so. <clears throat> in closing. Girls. Thank you so much for an enjoyable weekend. I did this weekend just for each and one of you guys. I know things didn't go according to plan. Things didn't go the way that we wanted. Some of us didn't. You know. But girls. I'll be sending um, individual me uh, video messages to you guys, um, saying personal thanks and giving some words of encouragement and definitely, uh, you know, just saying hello and stuff. Um, parents, to the ones who are watching, because I did meet some parents who actually watched my videos, and I was like, yay! So parents, if you guys are watching these videos, thank you so much for everything you do for these girls. They're amazing. You guys definitely raised them well. It's all thanks to you guys for helping out, helping financially, providing these dresses, providing these things. I saw one of the moms Moms left a note for one of their daughters. Oh, for Michaela's mom. Oh, she left a note for her daughter. Have fun. You know, call me if you need anything. Love, mom. And they made she made gifts for us. Thank you. So shout out to Michaela's mom if you're watching. Um, shout out to staff to this weekend who definitely helped me. Just shout out to everybody this weekend. Shout out to all y'all. You guys are awesome. I I could judges, staff, the restaurant people. <laughs> Some people, you guys are funny. You guys crack me up. <laughs> and yes, so thank you guys for watching my video. It's been like 13, 20 minutes long. And this is not going to be my last video, but it makes it sound like I'm making it. It's like kind of sort of my last, but anyways. So for the last time, as your 2011, 2000, oh, 2011 Miss California Teen Achieve. Thank you guys for watching my vlogs, and you guys are so amazing. Um, and have a wonderful night. Get some rest, because I'm definitely going to need that too as well. So thank you guys for watching. Good night.